Healthy man Maddie on the mic because I am no longer sick, which means I can actually hop on the mic now. Oh, that's in there? No. How he missed that? He's at 200. Okay, there we go. I'm like, he's, my boy is at 201% and he's living. Anyways, I wonder if uh, Cody did his homework because the last time I remember this matchup happened, Cody got, Cody got like put on his neck, like very, very bad, like a diseased animal. He like put on his neck bad. Wait, hold a second. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. That was that was the extreme second stock. That was his second stock, and Cody had him at 201%? What happened to first stock? I clearly missed something. I thought that was his first stock. Like, that would have that would have made a lot more sense if that was, like, homeboy, Homeboy's first stock. Anyways, Cody out here doing his homework, and see Extreme Pals again. These parries on him, and a nice good punish. Nice back here, catching a hot cha. Can't cha. You can hot cha your way into this diamond pickaxe. Ooh. I see, this, I see the vision of the Extreme, but unfortunately, we do not see the spot dodge. Ooh, nice F smash. I, I like the idea. I, again, like, it's, I, I can only say really, like, not. What the fuck? Forget everything I was gonna say. Y'all saw that. Y'all saw that fair, right? Bro, it was a forwarder, but it's like it collided with the block and it hit Jake literally at the top, like, literally the first active frame of the fair. Fancy, I agree. <laughs> Ban this corny ass character, aka Steve. But anyways, um, Cody showing that it's like, yo, Steve, not a problem. Check out how we deal with him over here on this side. All right, so we get in right back into the game number two. Small Battlefield being the pick. And I feel like this really is like a Steve stage, like Small Battlefield. There are two, pe there are two types of players I won't take here. I will never take Steve players here, and I will never take Quid here. That's just, that's just my thing. This is, this is Quid stage. <laughs> you don't take Quid to this day. I, actually, I want to see Quid versus like these top Steves. See how he does it. But anyways, ooh, ooh, nice back here. And the forward air just catching him trying to land it. You see, that forward air only hit because G-Extreme wanted to land with a button. And so my man's Cody is doing a very good job of punishing G Extreme right now. Look, he's, he's playing this calm neutral, tried to get a uh, Tomahawk grab in, but you know, G Extreme keeping Cody out as the way he should, as the way a Steve player should. Nice clean back air. Another back air. But now G Extreme has his offense going, and it's going strong. Oh no, that was a powered up minecart. Now he has Diamond online, and Cody's coming in with a... Oh! Oh, we almost got the... We almost got the Peach combos. But that... That was an Iron Pickaxe, and he got that first off without having to spend his Diamond. And that Up Smash will come in soon. LG Extreme definitely has a free opportunity to pull out his Diamond, but can he pull it out safely is the real question. Cody not able to get that big of a punish, but, you know, we keep it we keep it going. We keep the neutral going. Please do not SD, bro. Oh, my God. Here comes the Nair's train. Down throw back air, 71%. My man took it from 10 to 21. You hear the song in the back, and the song being like something that screams Arriba. That's what I wanted to say. I'd say when Peach hit that monster combo on G Extreme. Jesus Christ. That's broken. Anyways, <laughs> back to the match. 
Oh, offstage, not minimal resources. Very interesting way to try to get back to stage, but no, G Extreme gets pushed off. I think, I don't know what that recovery was. That was really, that was weird. Cody does not fear to Steve. He is approaching with a button and not worried about getting F smash. Uh, F smash, I meant to say. Uh, that up smash will clean, not clean up the stock just yet. Cody gets some big damage. Though. Oh, no, 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 no. Chill, 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 chill. I thought we were about to see like a zero to death combo, like the one he did on blank that one time. Yeah, but that down there will take the stock out. Good roll. I'm surprised even Steve could roll through his own blocks. Have a crown smack. Good spot, that's Cody tried to up the out of that. Nice. Tried to get another one there. I feel like I feel like we should be like trying to counter Steve's card. I mean, if you have a counter and Steve, you know he's not jumping out of that card. Counter that thing. Cody wanted to hit him with a fair. But I feel like he would have killed at that point. Ooh, I got up to back. It did not hit. The clean jab and that F smash will do it. Cody just tried to land with either an air dodge or a button into, into G Extreme. But that one, that just did not, did not look good. Did not look good for Cody over here. Anyways. So we're gonna have a game three. We're gonna push this a game three. Small bracket today, you know, 21 entrants. But no, the competition hasn't dwindled a little bit. Jesus Christ, that back row is needy. Prince Edgarding is insane. Anyways. Get it. Um, boom. I got 13. Too late. Anyways, Code G Extreme is now alive. Ah, uh, G Extreme be coffee, bro. But he be clean. Bubble be blank and no could be ice. Okay, I see. It. How can Cody bring this back? Or, you know, G-Stream, you know, he seems to be playing a lot more comfortable. You know, we keeping it on this stage. Cody not one to be scared of. Uh, personally, I would have chose to switch to a different stage. But then again, where would Peach like to fight Steve? I don't think Battlefield is one of them. Small Battlefield, I guess, works. Because, you know, it's not a lot of room for Peach. Wow. Screw a trade. That just straight up beat Peach's ass. Interesting form of block pressure by G Extreme. Another move that's just straight up beating Peach's ass. Uh, Steve back here. I mean, it's a disjoint. <laughs> Clean fair. And now G Extreme just has all the time in the space to just run away. Big damage on G Extreme now, but this is, I have to be very careful of how he's um how he just patrols around Cody because Cody is not he will not shy away to put those up smashes in G Extreme's face. Nice forwarder, but that forwarder is definitely stale now. And Cody missing another edge guard. Another Nair. But that ass mask will clean up. Very good, very good, very good. He's not out of the woods just yet. Nice stop. Oh my god. How did he find that F smash? You know, I, 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 why am I asking how Steve players find F smash? They just throw it out. And it just works for them somehow. I don't. Man, the guess is as good as mine. And now Cody, no, G Extreme with a whole stock lead. And that back is straight out of the minecart. Yeah, man. Cody did his homework, but G Extreme out here being the big studier on Cody's game plan. With the shield break, too? Jesus Christ.